A lot of people deal with anxiety, even our children and teens do. So coping with anxiety is absolutely essential so that they have skills and that we're able to support them when it's difficult. To learn some ways we can help our kiddos deal with anxiety, we turned to the conscious parenting revolution, parenting coach and parenting expert, Catherine Celery. First, you have to learn the signs that your child is going through anxiety. A lot of them don't know how to say, mom, dad, I'm suffering from anxiety. They just say things like, I hate school. Or they might bite down on their nails. They might twist their hair. There are different clues and signaling behaviors that we can pick up on and begin to go, hmm. Then try to sit down with them and talk about what's going on. Worries and fears always seem bigger and scarier when you don't talk about them. Ask your child to verbalize how they're feeling. She says, tell them to get as specific as possible about what they are afraid of and... Resist the urge to downplay their fears, to protect them. Assure them that they're capable of dealing with new challenges and that you'll be there to assist them should they feel they need it. Next up, name it to tame it. Naming it to tame it is having the words, knowing that this feeling inside is that word. For example, this feeling inside is worried. This feeling inside is anxious. This feeling inside is scared. Which is where parents can really step in. Teaching our children words to be able to express their feelings and then connect it to their underlying needs that are not being met. And then they can focus on meeting their needs and the feelings change. Then try to help them focus on the positive. Reframing negative thoughts with positive ones by focusing on what your kid could look forward to. For example, if they're anxious about starting a new school year, remind them that they'll be with friends or taking part in classes and activities that they enjoy. Helping kids by reframing in this language allows them a way to be present to what is, the worry, the fear, the anxiety, in a way in which they're able to be with it, but not overcome by it. Finally, it's important to build a routine. Kids need consistency and predictability to feel secure. And so these routines are really important, especially in difficult times. So establish that daily routine with your child that revolves around waking up, brushing their teeth, eating breakfast, and so forth. She says these habits will have your child feeling like, even though I may feel anxious, my habituated behaviors keep me moving down the track. Strengthening bonds with our kids while helping them deal with anxiety. We'll be right back. Right back. 